Welcome back to Tip TV Finance. We're joined now by Scott Grant, Director at London South East. How are you today, Scott? Uh, yes, I'm really good. As you can tell by my broad Scottish accent, I've bought the Grant tart and tie out as well for you today, Zach, so just to keep it in line. Well, uh, as I was born in Glasgow, I can appreciate these things. But um, let's go on to the, uh, uh, the hot, I think the hot stocks you've got for us today. Yes, yeah, so it's just what's hot on lse.co.uk. We offer a trading facility, and I tend to start there. So we've got London South East trading. Um, so the topmost traded is now this week 88E, 88E being part of the metals sector. Um, over the last uh, month or so, they've had very decent volume. Um, but then again, if you look at the last uh, three months, the chart is pretty volatile. But again, people on our site like the chance of uh, some uh, stratospheric growth. So 88E is our number one. At the bottom of our top five is IRG, Independent Resources. Um, possibly an interesting story. Yesterday, which was the 24th of October, their share price had a 100% rise. Um, sorry, in the last month, it's had a 100% rise. Yesterday, they announced they're changing Nomad as well. So it seems a, a company, again, of course, people are interested on our website, but also it seems an interesting play with the 100% price uh, increase uh, in the last month. Um, in terms of uh, most chatted, uh, still Highland Natural Resources is number one. Uh, in the last seven days, we've seen over 3,500 chat posts, so uh, uh, a lot of activity uh, on that board. Um, is the market, to... market it's sort of divided between that? Some people, a uh, few people don't like it, a lot of people do like it. It's, it's, sort of split, it's a bit of a love-hate situation, isn't it? Yeah, and we find exactly the same on the chat boards. Uh, we have full-time moderators, which uh, uh, I, I jokingly say it sometimes uh, devolves into a, a school playground mentality. And as you say, it seems pretty pretty split on, on the, the potential for that share. We've got the naysayers uh, and the advocates as well. So yeah, I, I, I totally agree with you there, yeah. Okay. And any other hot uh, situations? Yeah, we've got um, uh, number seven, I sound like uh, smashy and nicey here, yeah. but number seven on our most chatted is Hurricane Energy. Um, uh, they had testing on their Lancaster field uh, and found a flow rate of oil of uh, 14,500 barrels per day. Uh, I think they're aiming at a target of 17,000 uh, when production formally starts. So it's a quite an interesting story. Um, they've provisionally raised £70 million pounds worth of, of finance to obviously carry on with that production and testing. Um, and FinCap, the broker, has reiterated their buy with uh, a target of 72 pence. And I think at the moment it's in the 40s. So uh, Hurricane Energy becoming more and more chatted about and also seems a really interesting story uh, on the back of the Lancaster field. Um, one more I've brought in just today uh, that seems quite hot and quite interested to, to people on lse.co.uk is uh, Frontera Resources, uh, their code FRR. Uh, they released uh, an RNS also on the 24th. Um, work is underway. Uh, in stim the stimulation campaign for a further six wells uh, that they're currently working on. And that share, uh, I think it was up by about 20% yesterday. And I've just looked and it's gone up by another 11% as I, as I sat there today. So Frontera Resources is gaining some traction and some interest on lse.co.uk as well. Yeah, I just looked at that now as well, actually. It's uh, broken through its 200-day moving average. So uh, looking quite, uh, quite uh, intriguing at the moment. Absolutely. So quite hot on our site. Um, last thing to mention, as always, is our share views video. You've still got time, or it's on our YouTube channel, um, to watch Justin Tooth, the executive chairman of Ferrum Crescent. He was very interesting last week and uh, a great interview by, by your good self. This week we've got uh, Malcolm Graham Wood. Uh, he's uh, an advisor and he's probably quite well known to AIM investors in the oil and gas sector. Uh, this week he's talking uh, the oil price uh, and, and general sentiment, um, especially ahead of the next OPEC meeting uh, in Vienna. Right, so uh, plenty to look, look at and digest yes. there? Yeah, absolutely. As I said, the, the site is buzzing at the moment, so fantastic. Excellent. Uh, Scott Grant, Director at Ella, uh, London South East, rather. Thank you very much for speaking with us today. Great. Thanks, Ed. Thank you.